Hello, and welcome to our channel, where we explore the latest innovations in military tech. The Bayraktar TB2 is a Turkish-made unmanned aerial vehicle or drone developed by Baykar Makina, a Turkish defense company. It has gained recognition and popularity with over hundreds of units produced and exported to various countries around the world. It gained significant attention after its successful use in the Nagorno-Karabakh conflict between Armenia and Azerbaijan in 2020. In addition, since 2022, Bayraktar has been effectively used by Ukraine to protect its territories from the Russian army. The XQ-58A Valkyrie is a multi-role drone that comes in two versions, Block 1 and Block 2. Now, thanks to its open architecture, sensors and other systems can be quickly integrated into the drone. One of the advantages of a UAV is that it does not require a runway for takeoff. It's launched using a special launcher and Valkyrie lands on the ground with the help of a parachute. The Valkyrie is currently in service only with the US Air Force. The UAV will likely be used to penetrate enemy air defenses and operate with a high degree of autonomy, potentially as part of a drone swarm. The Aksungur is an unmanned aerial vehicle produced by Turkish Aerospace Industries. It's a medium-altitude, long-endurance drone that's designed for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions, as well as for conducting armed operations. The Aksungur is equipped with various sensors and cameras that provide it with real-time intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities. It also has a payload capacity of up to 750 kilograms, which allows it to carry various weapons and ammunition, including air-to-surface missiles and guided bombs. The MQ-9 Reaper is an unmanned aerial vehicle developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the United States Air Force. It's a hunter-killer drone that can be used for both intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions, as well as for precision strikes against enemy targets. It's equipped with a variety of sensors and cameras, including an infrared sensor, a synthetic aperture radar, and a multispectral targeting system. These sensors provide the drone with real-time surveillance capabilities, allowing it to detect and track targets on the ground from a safe distance. The X-47B Pegasus is an unmanned combat aerial vehicle developed by Northrop Grumman for the United States Navy. It's designed to operate from aircraft carriers and is intended to provide the Navy with a long-range high-endurance strike capability without putting pilots at risk. One of the key features of this drone is its ability to perform autonomous takeoff, landing, and aerial refueling. This allows it to operate from aircraft carriers without the need for a pilot to be on board, which significantly reduces the risk to human life. Bayraktar Kizilema is a flagship project of the Turkish defense industry. It should become the basis of the naval aviation of the Turkish fleet. This is a jet supersonic stealthy deck-based unmanned aircraft that is being developed as part of the Muharib Insansuz Uçak Sistemi project by the Turkish defense company Bayraktar Makina. In January of this year, Bayraktar Kizilema successfully completed its second test flight. It's known that Bayraktar Kizilema plans to equip it with the Ukrainian-made engine. The RQ-4 Global Hawk is a high-altitude, long-endurance UAV designed for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions. The drone is equipped with a variety of advanced sensors and communication systems, including electro-optical and infrared cameras, synthetic aperture radar, and signal intelligence equipment. These sensors provide the drone with real-time surveillance capabilities, allowing it to detect and track targets on the ground from a safe distance. One of the key features of the Global Hawk is its ability to conduct autonomous takeoff and landing operations. The Bayraktar Akinci is a larger and more advanced UAV compared to Bayraktar. It has a wingspan of 20 meters, making it the largest UAV ever produced in Turkey. One of the key features of the Bayraktar Akinci is its ability to carry a wide range of munitions, including air-to-ground missiles, bombs, and guided rockets. Additionally, the drone's advanced sensor suite and communication systems enable it to operate in contested airspace and to conduct a variety of missions, including intelligence gathering, surveillance, and strike missions.
The MQ-1C Gray Eagle is an unmanned aerial vehicle developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the United States Army. It's a derivative of the Predator drone and is designed to provide the Army with long-endurance, medium-altitude intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities, as well as the ability to carry out precision strikes against ground targets. It's powered by a heavy fuel engine that enables it to operate at high altitudes and in extreme weather conditions. It can be used for border patrol, disaster response, and law enforcement, among other applications. The MQ-20 Predator Sea Avenger is an advanced unmanned aerial vehicle developed by General Atomics Aeronautical Systems for the United States Air Force. It's an upgraded version of the MQ-9 Reaper drone and is designed to operate in high-risk environments and conduct a range of missions. One of the key features of the MQ-20 Predator Sea Avenger is its stealth capabilities. It's designed to be low observable, meaning that it can operate in contested airspace without being detected by enemy radar systems. That's all for our latest video on military technology. If you found it informative, be sure to hit that subscribe button and share your thoughts in the comments section below.